The P-3 Orion has been in service in the United States Navy for more than 60 years, spanning generations of pilots who used it as their instrument to carry out their mission and relied on it to get them home safely. The roar of four engines firing up one by one, a quick taxi, and then takeoff. A final goodbye with a wing wave to hundreds of Navy veterans and their families marked the end of the 60-year service history of the P-3C Orion as the last aircraft of its kind headed to the boneyard in Arizona. Just ahead of the send-off, former pilots, crew members, and support staff paid homage to the Orion. This plane has united six decades of naval aviators. The P-3 was formally introduced to the naval fleet in 1962 in response to the Soviet Union's growing number of submarines. It's seen action in every American conflict since the Vietnam War. The Orion is also just one of five aircraft that can boast more than half a century of service to the United States military. So this is the instrument that we use to propagate freedom. Captain Derek Eastman is the commanding officer of VP-30 at NAS Jax, which has trained service members on the P-3 since the 60s. And it is a special feeling to know that they're going out there to, to do the same exact things I was taught to do over 20 years ago. He says it's sad to say goodbye to the Orion, but its mission lives on in a new generation of aircraft tasked with carrying out the same critical role long into the future. The legacy continues, you know, we're literally taking that baton from one platform to another and the mission is the same. Here at NAS Jackson throughout the country, the P3's mission will largely and in many cases already has been replaced by the newer, more technologically advanced P8. But the decades of service the P3 contributed to protecting this country will never be forgotten by the countless men and women who worked on the aircraft. For local coverage, you can count on at NAS Jax. I'm Jake Stofan, Action News Jax.